students in this video we are going to see uh, pressure unit we are going to see in uh, two things one is an uh, SI system another one is a CGS system so SI system is followed in a uh, MKS unit okay it's meter kilogram second CGS system is followed centimeter gram second okay so first we should know what is uh, pressure okay consider I consider as a two object like this one is uh, like a cuboid another one is a sharp nail okay imagine both have the same mass okay it's small cuboid only okay so which is going to cause more pressure so which have the sharp edge this is going to cause the more pressure so from this we will come to know pressure is inversely proportional to the area okay so pressure is inversely proportional to the area directly proportional to the force there is more force more pressure will be created okay about area the less area okay less area is going to cause more pressure okay so less area is going to cause more pressure so pressure is equal to force per unit area now as i said we are going to discuss in this uh, video two units one is a si system another one is a cgs system okay so si system is follows in a mks unit and cgs system is follow in a centimeter gram second okay first we will do si unit okay so si unit of pressure so pressure is equal to force per unit area so pressure we can call it is a pascals pascals or we can call it is a pa pa also is going to represent as a pascals okay pa we can take it as a pascal so pa so is equal to the force force is a unit is a uh, newton okay force is a unit is a newton area is a pi r square or length into breadth whatever it is a meter square okay so newton by meter square so this is going to be a mk system newton already we know it is a kg uh, meter second minus 2 divided by meter square so this get cancelled how this became newton became as a kg meter second minus 2 so because f is equal to ma force is equal to mass into acceleration mass sc unit is a kg acceleration acceleration is a velocity by time meter by second square so from denominator i am taken as a numerator second so kg meter second minus 2 so 1 newton is a kg meter second minus 2 so we know what is 1 newton okay so we got kg meter second minus 2 divided by area is a meter square so meter meter get cancelled from denominator plus 1 is there i am taken as a numerator okay so we'll get as a kg second minus 2 meter minus 1 so it is a si unit of the pascal okay so it is a si unit of uh, pascals okay that is a followed mks system meter kilogram second again the same pascal i am going to tell you in a cgs system okay so cgs system what we can take it so i'll show in a second thing uh, it is a cgs system pressure unit we are going to represent in a cgs system centimeter gram second so as the same thing pressure is equal to force per unit area so pressure si unit is a pascals okay so pascals we are going to give in a, a cgs system okay cgs system fourth we can take it as a dyne and uh, area we can take it as uh, it is uh, length into breadth so centimeter 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 square okay so dyne by centimeter square or dyne dyne centimeter minus 2 because this uh, centimeter square i am taken as a numerator i'll get as a centimeter minus 2 okay now how we can convert what is dyne dyne is also a unit of the four uh, C, cgs system force unit okay so mass into acceleration mass we can take it as a gram acceleration is a velocity by time so meter by uh, second square centimeter by second square so gram centimeter second minus two it is a s a unit of uh it's a unit of dyne okay what is one dyne it's gram centimeter second minus two so now i got what is a dyne also okay it is gram centimeter second minus two centimeter minus two okay so here plus one here minus two is there gram centimeter plus one minus two second minus two so we'll get as a gram centimeter minus one second minus two from here also you can directly you can convert in cgs system so cgs system mass is representing gram time is representing second and uh, meter is representing as a centimeter okay the same unit we, we got in a cgs system this is a unit of pressure in cgs system okay it is a unit of pressure in mks system mks system now i'm going to show you how to find the dimensional formula for the uh, pressure okay so dimensional formula dimensional formula as we know um it is a kg meter minus two minus one second minus two that is the unit we got as in the mk system okay so here kg second minus two meter minus one so same thing i wrote dimensional formula for mass m length l uh, time is t 
so t minus 2 so it is a dimensional formula and it is a si unit okay the same thing it's in a cj system gram centimeter minus 1 second minus 2 so it is in a cgs system okay thank you if you like my channel please subscribe thank you